Hello and welcome to One North Maine, BCA's magazine show where we highlight the people, places and events that make this city, our city great. 2014, quite a year for Brockton and quite a year for BCA. We had more than 200 segments in our One North Maine episodes this year. We had a lot to choose from and we did it. So we're going to have our year in review. Sit back and relax and see what your community, the City of Champions, had to offer. Today we have a special edition, the Taste of Metro South. Alright Brockton, here we go, the Taste of Metro South. BCA Pride, Brockton Community Access Pride. Check it out. Check it out. Brockton Community Access. Thank you for watching. And the second one is an event recognizing the great work of a Brockton legend, Hilton Power. Let's take a look. My name is Hilton Parham Jr. Having this nice show. Well, the first time I picked up a paintbrush, I was four years old. So that was like 80 years ago. I used to do stick figures and then uh, put clothes on them in, uh, uh, with uh, watercolor. Nobody does festivals better than Brockton. I'm at Keith Field, the site of the annual Cape Verdean Festival. It's an event that we love to cover and the community loves to participate in. something a little different. I mean, it's 20 years later. We wanted to basically go back to the roots. That's why in the beginning we saw the little piece of carnival and stuff from, uh, from the old country. And um, we try to keep the music as traditional as possible. We also covered Summerfest. Wow, we have a blast every year. All right, here we are. Let's roll out. Wally Worldo will not let you down, Jay. Come on, Rex. Brockton Community Access Television. We see the fine work that our Brockton Fire Department does. We love you guys. Mwah. Thanks, Wally. Oh, 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 we try hard. Shouldn't have did that. Probably shouldn't have did that. Oh, cut, <laughs> cut that. No, nope, we can edit that out. We had an opportunity to cover fire department training. It was incredible. You'll enjoy it. Um, and, and, and that's the big part of it. We have to make sure we get everything open, everything clean, everything washed down. People say, well, why are they still putting water in the building? Why do they still have those hoses running? Why are they still breaking windows and getting the smoke out of the building? The quicker we can do that, the less damage it's going to do to the structure. We can, you know, people can replace things in the house. They can replace their televisions, their sofas, different things like that. We don't want them to have to re replace the actual structure itself. 
the Downtown Brockton Arts and Music Festival. It was simply incredible. We are into our fourth Downtown Brockton Arts and Music Festival, DBAM Fest 2014. We're expecting somewhere between 1,500 and 2,000 people by the time the day is over. There's a lot of people involved and we're having a real good time doing it together. And the more we do it, we've made new friends here today. There are new faces here now. I had young artists at my door, banging on my door at quarter eight in the morning going, can we please, you know, submit to the art show? Two thousand fourteen was a great year for government programming at BCA, and at One North Maine, we had an opportunity to cover the inauguration of a new mayor. Let us not seek the Republican answer or the Democratic answer, but the right answer. Let us not seek to fix blame for the past. Let us accept our own responsibility for the future. And we visited Southeastern Regional for an open house. It sounds like a blast. What's the best thing about Southeastern from your point of view? The people. It's such a great collection of people. We have people from all walks of life, uh, teachers that have been in industry, teachers that are academically inclined. We get kids from the city, we get kids from the suburbs. It's one big giant melting pot and I love everything about it. Well, there you have it, Brockton. 2014 in the books. It was a great year. Thanks to all of our volunteers and all of our community partners for the support throughout the year. To learn more about Brockton Community Access, please visit our website at bcatv.org. You can also check out our YouTube page, youtube.com backslash the Brockton channels, all one word. For everyone at One North Maine, I'm Jay Miller. We'll see you around town.